Good morning, everyone. So today is Sunday, August 25th, about 11 o'clock. I'm chilling out by the pool right now, uh, reading Good Omens. In about six hours, I'm going to be heading to the Knoxville airport and flying to Fort Lauderdale because tomorrow I'm going to be heading on the Disney Magic for the first time in five years. And I cannot wait to take you all along with me. Personal suitcase from London Fog. If you watched my uh, Smoky Mountain Fan Fest video, you got the details on that. I've got my outfit for tomorrow morning getting on the ship with my ears. I've got my passport and smaller items, uh, chargers, everything that I would need tomorrow on the ship. There's a possibility that we would not get our checked bag before the show or dinner. So just want to make sure that I have everything I need. Um, so I've got some other clothing items and I've got some toiletries and everything over on this side. And all right, I am all set for the airport. Got my book and all packed up, ready to go. Um, I did want to preface that I kind of have been sitting on the couch for about three hours, packed and ready to go because our flight is not until 8.25, so we don't have to leave for the airport until 5.45, but we're taking an Uber. So I'm about to book that now because we live like five minutes from the airport. So we should not have a problem. Let's head out. slash Port Everglades. We are probably a five mile drive to the port, maybe 10 minutes. We got the top floor. Our front desk agent was so nice. Honestly, getting off the plane was 
super smooth. We were in the ninth row, my mom and I. I was able to purchase TSA pre-check last week and get all uh, approved for that very easily. I was actually able to use my United Miles. Um, I have the United credit card and it only takes 11,000 United Miles to pay for TSA pre-check, which is good for five years before having to renew and it saved me $75. So I do have a link to apply for the United card and there will also be a little bonus if you are approved. Uh, so you can check that out down below. I wanted to mention there was a free shuttle from the airport to the Fairfield Hotel. Uh, our bag came almost right away as soon as the uh, conveyor belt started. The Fairfield shuttle was there almost right away as soon as we got to the stop for it. All super smooth, 10 out of 10. I am going to get some rest. Tomorrow's a very exciting day and I will see you all in the morning. Good morning, everyone. It is embarkation day. Um, I woke up at 5.30 and I did not mean to. My alarm was set for 6.30 because that's when breakfast starts. I just was, I don't know, starting to film a little bit of content for TikTok. Um, so if you don't follow me on there, I have my TikTok and my Instagram linked down below as well. It's been about an hour since I woke up and breakfast is about to start. Um, I don't know, I've been in the bathroom for a while, just kind of chilling, um, getting ready and stuff. So mom may be up, so I'm gonna go check and then get something to eat. Yay! We have the earliest port arrival time, which is 10.45. It's about 10.30 right now. We've got 15 more minutes. And so we're just gonna hang out right now. It's a little hot, a little humid. Not gonna lie, I did tear up quite a bit. Seeing the magic, so beautiful. I'm so excited. started planning out pretty much my entire week on the ship because they have opened up the itinerary on the app and I've connected my Disney band.
just like that, it feels like I never left. We stopped in Soul Cat Lounge and I was able to change our uh, dining rotation because when I checked the app, we had Lumiere's tonight and um, Animators tomorrow night and I wanted Rapunzel's on Tangled Night, which is tomorrow night. So I was able to change that around and I see Minnie Mouse, oh my goodness. So I just had a special moment with Minnie and I am looking through the art gallery right now. Mickey is out at 12.30 and my mom is in line to try to get Polo brunch reservations for our sea day. Alrighty, I just had lunch. It was fried rice and lo mein. I'm back on the stairs. I'm meeting Mickey. It's 12:30. State rooms are open in an hour. Let's see how much I can get done. Okay, so real quick room tour because we have an inside guaranteed stateroom, so it's not a lot to show, but we have our bathroom right here, and here I am. We got the tub, shower, shampoo and conditioner, plenty of towels, watch your step, and um... I did see a lot of uh, people wondering what exactly this is. It is a hairdryer. Just wanted to clarify that. Um, the ship is old, so that's why it looks like that. Anyway, here's the closet and the life vest that we fortunately do not have to put on for the mustard drill anymore. Big closet. Here we are, and the couch, the desk, and the TV. There I am again and the bed and we've got our castaway club gifts please take time to view the safety mustard drill is at 345 sail away is at 4 30. twice charmed is tonight and it's my favorite <laughs>
And I'm back in the stateroom, freshening up a little bit, and I'm going to wander around after hours a little bit, may get another drink. I got the uh, the New York Sour at Soul Cat Cafe, and it was truly an experience. He also came with a little pitcher of Cabernet Sauvignon to pour on top of it, and there were cherries, which I always love when a drink has cherries in it. Twice Charm tonight, which I have my Franco outfit. Franco de Fortunato. Uh, Twice Charmed is one of my favorite shows on Disney Cruise Line. So I'm kind of window shopping in the stores right now. They open at six o'clock and I fear they are going to take all of my money because everything looks so cute. It's all new stuff. I haven't been on the ships in five years, so I'll need um, one of everything. Yep, sounds like it. Mickey's main sale has a lot of the um, like collection stuff and some kids stuff. Look at the 2024, and then I see some really cute swimsuits over there. <sighs> Whether or not you'd like to hear the announcements, I describe myself a little cherry Moscow mule from O'Gills. And I'm kind of just hanging out, waiting for the doors to open for Twice Term, which should be opening at 5.30. So this show just went out and I always cry during Chasing a Dream and um, it was just amazing as always, the cast was so great. And I changed press and up, we have Animator's Palette tonight.
just left the Walt Disney Theater because they showed Deadpool and Wolverine in the Walt Disney Theater, which was a pleasant surprise because I didn't know they were going to be doing that. I thought they just did it for the premiere. It's 12.30 and I'm exhausted. I'm going to end this video here, but I will see you all in the next one. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe. Bye!